buddy. It's Lynn from Alaska. Um, I promised a few people that I would show you the RV uh, where we spend most of our summers. And so I just wanted to show you the outside real quick and then I'll show you the inside. Uh, each one, is, like this for example, this door here is our propane. And you leave that on when you're driving so that your refrigerator will always stay on. And then each one of these compartments locks and you can put stuff all the way through to the other side. And this is where the heater system blows the exhaust out. And then there's a great big compartment in the back. So um, on the other side, I'll show you the other side real quick. Sorry, it's kind of mushy back over here. It's still muddy. You can see how the, the inside of it has a slide to make the rooms bigger. And all those compartments that were on the other side, they're all, they all come through all the way down here. And back here, it's kind of hard to do with the camera. <laughs> feel like I'm doing a commercial. If any of you have seen RV, you know that you have to empty your septic when you're done camping for the weekend. And this is the door where that is. And uh, I'll show you sometime how to empty it. Sometime when we're coming back from a trip, I'll, I'll show you. And over here is where you hook up to the electric and you can either run your generator like if you're in a remote campsite you can run your generator which runs off the gas in your tank and it doesn't run your tank down past uh, an eighth so you don't have to worry about running out of gas and usually the generator lasts about a week if you you know if you're just running off that and that runs everything inside the TV the refrigerator the whole bit and the only time you use propane to run your refrigerator is when you're driving and you don't have electric available. So, and then that, this compartment here goes all the way through to the other side too, so it makes a huge, I don't know if you can see that or not, but that large compartment right there 